episode three. Honestly, I forget the tile's name, but just let's just get into it. New World Order. That's it. New World Order. Everything's dark, quiet. It's empty. No sign of the children of Arkham. They may not have gone far. They should be there. No security, no emergency staff. If Vicky's right, it shouldn't be this quiet. Be on your guard. I'll continue monitoring the drone feeds from here. Thanks. Go and have a look around. There's a body here. Likely the work of the children of Arkham. I'm gonna look around, see what they've been up to. Alright. They already killed the cops. He's been dead for a while from the looks of it. The officer that was taken from the construction site, shot in the chest. Oh, how terrible. There's something else. He was shot dead center, twice, executed. I suppose they no longer had need of a hostage. This man's veins. They look like, like Montoya's, Montoya's veins after yep. she was drugged, only they're so much worse. The same drug from the debate. I feared we hadn't seen the last of it. There's no puncture mark here. No entry point for an injection. So, how did it get in his body? There's nothing to link to. Yet. They've been referencing the map. Whatever they're building must hinge on it somehow. This depot is pretty centrally located. Oh, what's that timer? Wait. A detonation device, but it's disabled. They must have intended to hook it up to something. The timer is set for 27 minutes and 13 seconds. From now? The numbers aren't moving. Doesn't seem to be counting down yet. This is how they were timing their route. Alfred, what stations are within a 27-minute train ride from this depot? I'm looking into the transportation database now. Sir, there's just one. Mercy Street Station. It's one of the busiest places in the city. Thousands of people go in and out every hour. These barrels match the shrapnel that I found at the docks. Let's see. They're probably... Maybe? Mercy Street. But how are they planning to release it? No, 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 no. It has to be this and the chemical. Or... Someone's been practicing chemistry. What's this? The empty container is part of the cob. This solvent increases dermal permeability. Looks like they ran out of the absorbing agent. Or no, the spill. Something spilled here. This is the drug they've been using. Refined. It's the same as the one given to Montoya and Harvey. We're actually I'm curious. Maybe this is a long shot. But... They've altered the drug so that it can be absorbed through the skin. Yeah. And then this does go here. Mercy Street. But how are they planning to release it? Okay, yeah, so that one's right. Is that can't be like canceled? So maybe the drug is being modified here. They're changing it. Okay, so that's right. There's probably another song. Wait. 
This train car has been modified. How do you mean? Clearly the holding tank. It's empty. For now. Easy access. The train car was raised to make working beneath it easier. They wanted to get this done fast. Looks like some kind of sprinkler system. Doubtful they're planning to put out fires. The train okay. car is their delivery system. Maximum coverage. So they're gonna make it rain the chemical, I'm assuming. On Mercy Street. That's what I would think. A modified train car is going to be sent to Mercy Street Station. The drug. The children of Arkham must have found a way to weaponize it. With a drug that can absorb into skin, it will affect hundreds of people at once. They're loading the modified drug into the tanks on the train cars, dispersing it through the sprinklers. The timers are set to go off just as it rolls in over the crowds. We are prepared to contain something of that scale. Releasing a drug like that in so populated an area would be devastating. They could infect the entire city if they had enough. Thankfully, there wasn't enough of the chemical to mix with the rest of the stockpile of drugs. There's a train coming. Take cover. See, I think instead of Lady Arkham, I think the main thing is to scare And have it rain here. I, don't, I just think that's something scary about people. And he's also well more known villain. If I'd known you were gonna make me lug this thing myself, I would have worn more comfortable shoes. Just add it to the list of your mistakes. Must be why you didn't come through on your last assignment. Hmm. It's all here. Okay, you two, get these mixed, loaded onto the train. This way. Their leader is here, with Catwoman. Catwoman? She's got more of that absorbing agent. She must have a good reason for being there. She plays whatever side meets her needs. Currently, her needs seem to be focused on keeping all nine of her lives. We're done here, right? Not yet. No, 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 no. There's no part two of this. I got what you wanted. I'm done. You might as well come out, Batman. I know you're here. No, no way. I did not bring him here. I honored our deal. Oh, I know you did. But now, you're a loose end. Surrender. Unless you'd like to see firsthand what a critical dose looks like. She joined poor Esther Cobblepot. Death might be preferable. I know what you have planned with the Skyrim. It's not going to happen. Then killing you both will have to be a consolation prize. Thanks, Bats. Train's ready! Move out! Bring me away.
just like the Don't pass out on me. Come on, bats. Stay here, okay? Just don't move. I'm fine. I just need to get back out. That might work on your butler, but I'm not buying that crap. Stay there. Shit. You're lucky you were wearing that suit. You know that was stupid, right? Uh, huh. What? Showing up at that train depot. Taking on their leader alone. Repeat after me, Bruce. I am not invincible, and painkillers do not solve the problem. You weren't gonna take them down on your own. They would have killed you. No. no it it's not that worse. bad. I've been through worse. Funny. Any worse, and you'd be sent home in a body bag. <laughs> I don't think you're getting very far with a shoulder like this. Oh, great. You can stay here until morning. I feel like I owe you anyway. That's twice now. You just keep adding things to my list, don't you? Selena. I told you I don't like owing people. Probably best to lie low for now anyway. I don't want the children of Arkham finding this place. I had it handled, you know. With their leader. I had a plan. Really didn't need you swooping in and messing it up. I was there, tracking the children of Arkham. I had no idea you'd be there. Must have been quite the surprise. Yeah. Yeah, it was. That was gonna be my ticket out of here. One last job to get the goons off my back. So much for that. Thanks again, Bats. 
I'm sorry I messed things up for you back there. I know. I'm used to it anyway. There's no such thing as a fresh start. Well, look who's back. Hey, little one. I don't think she likes you. <laughs> okay, she really doesn't like you. I'm not sure I care much for her either. Way to win her over. <laughs> Cut it out. This really hasn't been your week, has it? <laughs> you think? I lost my company, my reputation, and I find out my father was... Just like everyone else. They've all got something to hide, Bruce. Every last one of them. Even the so-called good guys. There's always something. You're wrong. There are good people out there. Honest people. Care to introduce me to one? Come on, Bruce. Even you have your secrets. Those things you hide from the world and won't let anyone else see? Yeah, well, the difference is my secret doesn't hurt anybody. And then you're better than most. You're a good man, Bruce. But good men don't lie with thieves. I know what I am. No noble intentions. Just the thrill of breaking what they say can't be broken. Knowing there's no safe I can't crack. No fortress I can't infiltrate. Proving I no, can. Batman, Batman, You're just I listing all the things something. I like about you. <sighs> now you've ruined it. What? Nothing. I've stolen from corrupt jerks like Hill, but... I've taken plenty from good people, too. <laughs> For what? Some shiny new toys in a crappy apartment on the edge of town? The high is nice, but it wears off. Then you look around and see... Nothing. So you get back out there. Try and chase that feeling down. It's not the same, but... I know what you mean. After everything we do, everything we're capable of, coming home just feels... Like a disappointment. Right. Uh, got Riz her up. Batman. Batman's got Riz. I was hoping for something more than that. Uh, Batman. Nope. That man, Catwoman. Gotta do it. I'll make it up to you. Do I have to do all the work myself? Or are you gonna undo this for me? I think I'd rather watch you.
What's this? Bruce? Morning, Alfred. Oh, thank goodness. I was worried. I hadn't heard from you. I didn't know what happened if if you were I'm sorry, I didn't uh, mean to worry you. Alfred. Out, Alfred. Well, I'm just glad you're okay. <laughs> Loki. I always fear the day you don't come home, Bruce. I know well. Where are you anyway? I uh I stayed at Selena's last night. Oh. Well, that certainly explains it. You got something to say, Alfred? I'm not judging you. Yeah, that's not, not like how you I, were. I'm not I did not think he was gonna say it like that. While you're there, this might be a good opportunity to learn more about Miss Kyle. After all, we really don't know anything about her. See what you can find lying around. No, that yeah. means paranoid. You gotta do it. That's a smart paranoid. idea. I'll see what I can find. At the very least, you can find that grapple gun of yours. Right. That might be harder than you'd think. She doesn't share your love of organization. Bro, I'm looking for well, I'll see you back at oh, wait, home, no. Bruce. That's hers. That little toy. Pretty strong magnets on these things. Very lightweight, though. We could use something like this. You know what? Yeah, we could. We're just gonna... We could use it more. Is that my grapple gun? Yes, it there is. There you are. I uh, hope she didn't break anything. So what we got in here? It looks all right to me. Nothing growing, at least. At least she's got the essentials. I, uh, I brought breakfast. C can I come in? I don't know if that's such a good idea. Just for a minute. I really need to talk to you. If you want me to go, I'll go. Oh, shit. But I, wasn't paying I attention. have to get this out. Bruce? What the... Seriously. What are you doing here? Have a seat, Harvey. No! I don't need to sit down. Bruce, tell me what is going on. I oh, just came shit. by to check on Selena. What, with your pants off? Back off, Harvey. Don't! Don't touch me! I thought I would come here and... <sighs> so stupid! God, I should have known. I should have known that you would do this to me! Not if it was real anyway. God, how could you ever think it was? None of this is about you, Harvey. But so I'm just making this up? Yes, you are. This had nothing to do with you. He... He will not be able to protect you. And I don't need him to. Just... get out of here, Harvey. What happens when the children of Arkham come for him? You think you won't get caught in the crossfire? You can't stop them! He can't. I may go down for what my father did, but I won't take her down with me. She'll be fine. Ah, oh, funny. Thinking you have a choice. Thinking you can save the people around you. Thinking you could do what Harvey couldn't! I'm sorry. What the hell is going on with you? Up until now, Harvey has been weak. He's been afraid. Oh my god. This... This is the monster they all know that you are. Embrace it! No! No! Uh, oh god, this is what you wanted to see, isn't it, huh? The freak! Harvey. Yeah. All right, now you've got two seconds. Or what? Harvey won't be pushed around anymore. All right. No, he's gonna make them pay. Everyone who thought they could hurt him and get away with it. Starting with you. Both of you! You're gonna pick that up. Who am I? No, Harvey, no, you are our boy. friend. We don't want to fight you. What if I do? 
Harvey, you're my boy. Don't, don't look at this. Jesus, Harvey. Of course, I gotta be fair about this. Can't play favorites. They both deserve it, one way or another. Uh, how about we flip for it? This isn't funny. No, no, it really isn't. Selena, looks like you're first. No, no. no you're not doing that now. <laughs> Always getting in the middle of things. Stay the hell away from me. The call's already been made. Harvey. Bruce. No, I don't want to hurt you. This isn't, they turned their backs on you. Harvey, put oh, the knife okay. down. Selena! He's gonna hurt someone. You know we can take him out. Have you lost your mind? No. No, he's my Harvey. boy. I can't. I, no, not yet. You need to calm down. What are you doing? No going back now. All right, yep. Yeah. He's gone. Two-Face is born. Nope. Enough. Oh, God. Please. I don't want to be alone, Bruce. Please, not with him. I can't. Oh God, I can't listen to him. Who are you talking about? There's no one else here. No, it's, it's no one. It's just me. My fault. Harvey, don't. Bruce, I... I don't think we can help him. Not on our own. It's just me. It's just me. It's just me. It's just me. He's my That's friend, my Selena. I'm not going to abandon him. He needs professional help. Help you can't give him. It's okay, Bruce. I'll go. I don't deserve your help. Go off with your tail between your legs. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Harvey! <sighs> so much for this place. I'm not gonna stick around and wait for him to come back. I thought it would be a while before I had to move again. Yeah, you're right. It's not safe to stay here. And I'm not sure I'm gonna find another place with this kind of private access. Ugh. Maybe I'll live on a boat. <laughs> Kidding. <coughs> yeah. That means you too. <sighs> we won't go far. Don't worry. You should come stay with me. Uh, I don't know. There's plenty of space. Alfred could set up a guest room for you. I'll think about it. <sighs> Great. What was that about? I'm supposed to announce my resignation at a press event today. Somehow try to appear happy that Oswald Cobblepot is taking my job. Sounds like an opportunity. How do you mean? They screwed you out of your own company. You have all this information that could bring them down, and they're handing you a live mic. So use it. I need to warn everybody right. about the children of Arkham. They have big plans for Gotham. Hopefully they'll listen. You better get going. I've got some packing to do. The offer still stands. Sounding no, better like, and what better I should do is just like say the first line and they'd be like, This is a lie. I'm sorry about all this, Bruce. 
We've... Uh, we've prepared a brief damage control statement to make this easier. After I introduce you, all you'll have to do is read what's on the teleprompter. And then I can take it from there. Got my little coronation speech Damn, just sorry waiting. about the eye. And please, Bruce, try to be on your best behavior. Did I actually the very that? best. Wouldn't want to bring any more shame to the Wayne family name. Now would we? Yo, can I mention his eye? No. I know it's unfair to ask this of you, but That's please. Bullshit. Right now, your reputation, your entire legacy, depends on your cooperation. Get through today, and I can help you. I can convince the board to bring you back. It might not be CEO, but it will be something. You're right. This is my legacy, and the only reason I'm putting up with this charade. Yes. Well, as long as you cooperate, I suppose your motivation is irrelevant. Bruce, what's your opinion of the Shiner? Regina wanted me to cover it up with makeup. She doesn't think it looks very dignified. But here I think it's a fine display of what the moral high ground looks like. Mr. Cobblepot. All in good fun, honestly. <laughs> a thrown punch is just water under the bridge. Right, Bruce? Boys are just being boys and all of that. No hurt feelings, I'm sure. Bruce just didn't like nah. losing the office. It's not the black eye that makes you undignified, Oz. Hey. Will you two please stop this? You're both professionals. It's time. Bruce, I'm going to introduce you and then you're on. Please, stick to the teleprompter. Good morning, everyone. And thank you for being here. Wayne Enterprises has always taken its role in the community very seriously. Isn't it funny? And we've all How everything I said to you in the park has come true. Me, taking everything that's yours. And that's not even a punchline. No, dear. Not even close. No one's going to follow you around and take pictures now. It'd almost be sad if you were so bloody handsome. You're just a pawn, Oswald. And everyone knows that pawns are meant to be sacrificed. Yeah, no, perhaps. But at least I, I get like the joy of watching your shocking and surprising descent first. This Thomas is just a first step we towards making things right. Soon enough, it'll be Cobblepot Industries, Cobblepot Medical, on and Cobblepot Tech on tops of buildings, and, and you, Waynes, will be what you should have been all along. A forgotten footnote. Cobblepot Damn. will come to mean the future of Gotham. And Wayne will be a star. Nah, no he's getting personal. So what the Wayne built would not have been possible without the Cobblepots, Oswald. I suppose you deserve it as much as I do. Bloody right, I do. Oh, no. coming around to my way of thinking. That's not how I thought you were. Oh, I forgot to mention. Oh. I did some digging. And you know how old Hill admitted he had your mom and dad killed? I found out why he did it. Oh, yeah. And I'll tell you the story, but only if you say, pretty please. It's quite the page, Turner. I'm sure you're just dying to hear it. Just tell me. I have to know. Nah, uh, uh, that's not what I asked. Pretty please. Turns out your dear mum found out what your daddy was up to. Threatened to turn him in, she did. She said she didn't want to be a part of it. Now you can imagine, Hill wasn't too keen on that idea. So he slid a few dollars Joe Chill's way, and, well, you saw the rest, mate. And now, wow. Bruce Wayne would like to say a few words. Remember, enjoy yourself, Bruce. After all, you never know how much time you really have left. <sighs> No, I'm not saying that. I'm stepping down from my position as CEO of Wayne Enterprises. But I am not doing so voluntarily. The board of Wayne Enterprises has voted me out. At a meeting, I was not invited to attend. That's her fine. I was okay, horrified to learn of my that father's corruption. I am ashamed of his actions and would like to apologize to Gotham for the pain he has caused so many of you. I'm sorry. 
That's it, mate. I worry for the future of Wayne Enterprises. The decisions well, made in the next few speech. days will be critical in shaping what that future will be. Careful, Bruce. No, 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 no. My replacement, Oswald Cobblepot, is a member of the Children of Arkham. They control his every move. Security! Step back, Mr. Wayne. Yo, that was a fire speech. Ah, that was quite a show you put on, Bruce. <clears throat> My apologies. Folks, please forgive me, Mr. Wayne. Everyone. I, for one, completely understand his behavior today. Nice After statement. All, he is the press seemed to eat it up. I rather enjoyed it myself. Vicky, go it away. Quite hard. It sounds like your days of giving orders are through. It's not an easy thing, seeing something you've come to have. Dropped your pen. Your That's not... <coughs> <You're yourself coughs> taken over by another. I should know... Oh, I'm shit. Sure you, you feel that? That's the drug taking hold of you. Now it you? Dirty You're with the children of Arkham. The no, I the am the children of Arkham. Of Yo, how are these reporters not even here? I think it's time you knew my real name. I, I am Lady Arkham. And you already know the Penguin. Look at him up there, taking Yo, everything that should belong to you. This? Mocking you, slug, insignificant bastard. He thinks he can get away with it. Because none of them know who he really is. They wouldn't believe you if you told them. And if we could just get one more round of applause for our friend, the man of the hour, Bruce Wayne! Someone's a little touchy, it seems. It would be so easy to get rid of him. Who else will deliver justice? Wait, only 39% chose to help Harvey? Alright, like... I don't know if they're we're going for the Two-Face arc there, but I mean... He already had the face. I mean, Harvey's also your boy. Alright, so 32% kept their cool. I mean, lost their cool. Damn. I was not with it. Okay. Well, that's where I was with people on that. Same, okay. So now they're starting to show loyalty to the boy. All right. After his shocking and atrocious display of violence towards Oswald Cobblepot and members of the press, Bruce Wayne has demonstrated a clear lack of mental stability. That is why, regrettably, I made the decision to have my old friend hospitalized in Arkham Asylum. Batman, the children of Arkham, the Penguin. Doesn't Gotham already have enough deranged criminals terrorizing its streets? I believe that Gotham's citizens deserve to be safe. That they deserve to be protected. Even if that means I have to do it myself. With the children of Arkham out in full force, we need him now more than ever. Where is Batman? All right. Well, until next time, I guess. So the next episode, I wonder what that's called. I don't want one got two more to go. Guardian of Gotham.
I'm not gonna lie. The city of light cover that actually looks hard. Alright. Guardian Gotham. So I'm probably gonna start working on that and I'll just upload them tomorrow. Till then, peace out.